here. I hope you enjoyed my new intro, it's something I've been working on for the past week. Anyways, I'm sorry I've been MIA so long, I was absolutely swamped with exams and assignments, all that fun stuff. Now that I'm on winter break, I'll have some more time to get back to posting stuff and more often than I have been, and I figured what better way to celebrate the holidays than to post something that you guys can laugh at. It made me laugh anyways, maybe that's just me. Anyways, I really hope you guys enjoy it. Let me know what you think in the comments, and uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Once, in a place far away, a very long time ago there was a boy named Roger. He was tall, but a bit round. He lived in a big city where unusual things seemed to happen every day. For example, his uncle died. Anyway, Roger had lots of enimes in the city, but the people he used to like were now his enimes because he changed. He used to be a really successful banker named Ron, but he decided to go another way, and now he has a hobo named Roger. Because of this, his friends thought they didn't like him anymore, so they said, You're our enemy now! And Roger was like, Oh no, I have no friends but loads of enimes. Roger lives day to tomorrow by the change he gets off strangers outside McDonald's, but sometimes he. When he gets enough money, he goes to the local shopping center called Tico. He can only buy things when they are on sale, so he only buys things when they are on sale, because he doesn't have much money. Sometimes, he even gets enough change to buy chicken when it's on sale, and he goes to KFC and says, Can you cook this for me? And they do it, because they are his enzymes and spit in the food. Yuck. Today, on the most windy and stormy and rainy and cloudy and sad of days, he decided he needed to eat and went to Tico. When he went inside, there was no baskets. This was weird. Roger thought that that must be giving them a break today, so he kept going. He saw that the uh, bread was on sale, so he was going to buy it, and then a big fat hairy man ran up to him and said, No, that is not for you, and he took the sale sign away, which made the bread go back up to $100,000. This is all in the future, so that's, that's normal for the future. Roger made a face similar to this, and he said, But if you don't give me that, I will starve. And the fat man laughed, and his fat went bouncy from laughing. <laughs> his fat went bouncy from laughing. Then one of Ron's enzymes died, so Ron felt his anger rising. That happens when his enemies die and punched the man so hard that his fat fell off and the man was so angry that he cried blood. <laughs> then the lights went out so fast that Roger knew he was going to be murdered. A black mist came out of the cereal boxes and the bacon was flying everywhere. Pancake mix splashing all over the counters, freezers freezing at higher temperature than norm that normal, so it was freezing the frozen pizza zaz. Too much. Ron ran way far away to the aisle that was always that's always full of people. It has like loads of sweet and crisps. Yummy. There was like ten, no wait, fifteen monsters there. All black with eyes oogieing with blood and tears that looked like bacon but were actually dead people's skin. He screamed, Fat Man help! But when the fat man came her, he said, You punched my fat, and now you will pay. I am your enime. And he ran and went ew inside a freezer, but forgot that the freezers froze too hard, and he died from freeze. Roger ran to an exit, and was almost out when he trapeed on something. He looked down, and saw his enemy saying, Help me! The pancakes were too string. And then he said, No, I am Roger. You were Ron's friend, not mine, Smelly. And he ran out the door. He was safe. He got out. He escaped. He avoided death. He was alive. He was tall. He was safe. He was Roger. 
Then he went he back in for the bread, but forgot about the monsters! So when he got the bread, the monsters came out between the slices, and cried blood from their months, saying, We are your enemies, Ron. He said, How do you know my old name? And then they ate him, and he just fell down on the floor, crying from death. His last words were, I am all your enemies. Then he fell down and died. Just before he died, he said, I will now be a supermarket monster. So when you are in a supermarket, remember that Ron is waiting. In the future though, because it's in the future, remember?